All right, guys. I have a uh, a marbled salamander here. It's an uh, ambi snowmid, and it's a lifer for me. And uh, I found it near this vernal pool, under this exact log right here. So the the marbled salamander is, uh, I guess, a fairly common species here in North Carolina. It's just they're uh, pretty secretive animals. And uh, you can see they have, try to be gentle, they have a, uh, a banded appearance, like it's white and black stripes. It's kind of hard to see. But uh, yeah, very beautiful. This looks to be a uh, juvenile. What's interesting, uh, Smet Logic brought this up, but what's interesting about these guys is that the females will actually lay the eggs under the leaves when the pool when the when the uh, pools of water are dry and they wait for the eggs or for the water to rise and then the eggs hatch so which is pretty interesting and they guard their babies and uh, I'm not quite sure but I think this is either a juvenile or maybe an adult a small adult very beautiful little guy here's the uh, striped thing I was talking about sorry for my camera shakiness but uh, you can see what I mean they're grayish white color and this is ambistoma op opacum I believe not quite sure so uh, yeah I'm gonna let this guy go and I'll see if I can find some more sharing a home with the wood beetles cover them back up. Here's a very, it's another very common uh, uh, salamander. This is Plethodon chlorobrinus or the Atlantic Coast Slimy Salamander. See the white speckling on the side? Very common. 